this is the fourth month that I've been laid off as a data engineer. And I've been making this series to discuss and be transparent with you guys about my journey, how I've been trying to recover from this layoff. I have over five years of experience in data engineering. I want to tell you guys about what I've been doing for this month and what I'm going to be doing to prepare for next month in my goals of gaining more visibility in tech and then also building up my business and generating income whether that is generating income from my business and or getting a new job my goals when i first started this series is to immediately go right back into getting a job but after going through so many interviews going through so many hiring processes talking to so many different recruiters applying to over 500 jobs I just realized that getting a job right now is extremely difficult and is more difficult than it really needs to be. And of course, I'm not talking about just getting any job. Getting a job that anybody can get is not going to help me to grow within my own life and my career. And it also will hurt me in my chances of being able to better afford my living situation and being able to take care of myself and my family, which is my biggest goal. So usually it takes around three months in order to get a job, but because the market is so competitive right now, I've been unemployed for over four months. And what did I have to do during that time? I had to ramp up my business. And what I did was I started doing consulting work. It's starting to finally pay off where I'm getting income from doing consulting. And I'm also getting income from creating content. I'm gaining more visibility through creating content. And it has helped me not only emotionally, but then also financially. There actually is something here in content creation, in consulting work. I have gotten my clients through networking events. What I have been able to do is create my own contracts and start working for small businesses that need help in something I know how to do. And it's easy for me to do because I have the technical expertise in order to do it. Another thing I wanted to point out is a lot of the wins I've been having outside of the job hunt and the job search because I have been recognized as a member of the month for the Urban League of Greater Atlanta for Young Professionals and I have been contacted for several different speaking engagements. People want me to lend my expertise and talk to large audiences about what it is to be in tech or how to grow within your career. And what I'm noticing now in my career is that I'm getting more tough. I'm starting to be more assertive as time goes on because I'm working with so many different personalities. I'm meeting so many new people. I have people come up to me all the time and say, hey, your, your face looks so familiar. I may have seen you somewhere. And it's either through consistency on social media and posting about my journey, or it's through me going to different networking events and people just seeing me at multiple different places. I made a post on LinkedIn I want to be paid to learn, and this is a quote from Mark Cuban. Let me share a career secret that's driven my success. I'm a lifelong learner and there's an infinite amount of things to learn. Being strategic about what you invest time in is key. After graduating college, I leveraged my skill set to land roles at large Fortune 500 companies, working on projects that generated millions of dollars in value. However, after a layoff, I faced the challenge of finding a new job. I did what everyone says, built personal projects, learned new technologies, took courses, earned certifications, but saw little return. And then I shifted my approach. I used my skills I already had to help small businesses with their projects, and I began getting paid to learn. I applied my corporate experience in building websites, something many small businesses need but don't have the time or desire to do themselves. I became a host gator affiliate partner. I've built websites that have directly helped people grow their businesses. You can build something for your resume or you can build something with purpose. So I made that post because I wanted to inspire more people to go their own route. If they are dealing with a hard time with their job hunt and they're not making any income, you can save up a lot of money. But if you have responsibilities, that money can go away super quickly if you don't have any income coming in. Your network is your net worth and a company's value is directly tied to their network. Please go ahead and like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. 
and also hit that bell notification icon if you want to be notified whenever I make new videos on YouTube. Please go ahead and check out the Before the Billions website so that way you can join the newsletter. And with that being said, guys, do not forget to build your billions. Money work.